You find it? I did, I did. It must have fallen out of my purse and gone under the armchair. Good. Oh, <laughs> I interrupted your drinking fun to go look for my key. Have a seat, I'll introduce you. This is Matei, a friend of mine. <laughs> Dairy is our neighbor from the palace next door. Nice to meet you. I came here straight from the harem. <laughs> The harem? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Derry is an actress from The Harem, a TV uh, series. Well, it's how I make my bread and butter. Oh, why was he? No, 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 I already interrupted your conversation. Don't get up, how oh, come you. on, at least have a little something. Sit down. I've already put a plate and fork, come on. Mmm, what a trickster you are. You know you should really be offering what you're drinking, not what you're eating. <laughs> you have as much as you'd like. <sighs> oh, thank God we had these vests on. Dodged that bullet. Dude, I saw the light, I swear to you. It was the headlight, brother, that's all. Just a headlight. Who the hell were they? I guess they must have been protecting the trucks. Uh, then who were the ones who rescued us? They were Nahat's men. Didn't you hear him say to take the truck from Mr. Nahat's garage tomorrow? But why did Nahat do it? Because he thought that we were his disciples. And to send the message that we can't do anything without him already knowing about it. Oh, what a crazy roller coaster this has been. We were beat up yesterday, we were shot today. <sighs> Who knows what'll happen tomorrow? <laughs> I haven't laughed that much for a long time. Thanks, Amir. Brother, thanks so much. Brother, man. Uh, then uh, talk to my father tomorrow. That'll help you make a better decision, and then we could talk later. Okay, sounds good. Hey, Daria, you have a good night, huh? Good night to you, darling. <laughs> hey. I'll see you around. I can take you to the harem if you want. I don't really want you walking alone at this time of night. No, it's close. I can walk by myself. Well, I left the car at the parking lot. I can get it tomorrow. I'll walk you there and then catch a taxi from there and go home. Okay, yeah, if you want. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Mr. Yigit is here, brother. Come on in, Yigit. You're right on time. Thanks. But I can come later when it's more appropriate. We all know each other here. I've come to thank you for last night. The company had the truck followed. If your men hadn't come to help us out... You have no reason to thank me. You are under our protection now. It's normal. We're always looking after you. Newbies always need some help at first, you know. <clears throat> Otherwise, they would mess up on a daily basis, right? Is your friend doing okay? So I guess everyone knows all the details already. Very nice. Don't stress yourself out. Ghoul, give him something to drink so he can relax a little. <laughs> of course. We're having a meeting now. Come, Sarila. So I guess what this means is, it means that you still have a long way to go, Master Yigit. These things aren't as easy as they may seem to novices. You're the one with a long way to go, old man. Who do you think you are, huh? <laughs> Did you really think that you could mess with me? Do you really think that, that you can handle a more experienced man like the great Sadala? <clears throat> you came from your village and messed up everything and was ruined within a month. Haven't you learned your lesson yet, boy? What a slow learner you are. Brother Nihat is waiting, Mr. Sadala. As I said before, boy, you can come to me for help at any time. Uh, it's our duty as experienced professionals to guide the young newbies like yourself down the right path. I'll be the one teaching you the lessons, old man. 